Hello everyone. How are you? I hope you all are happy and healthy. Today we are going to prepare something that will make you thirsty. Let's make lemonade fruit afza. Okay. First of all, let me tell you one thing. You have to listen the whole recipe very carefully because I am going to ask you so many questions out of this. So let's begin. My step number one is take a glass full of water. Step number two is take one spoon of sugar and add into water. And stir it well. My step number three is take two spoons of lemon juice. I have already squeezed lemon in this bowl. Spoon number one and spoon number two. Okay. Now my step number four is take ruabza, yummy ruabza, and add. Two spoons of ruabza into the lemonade and stir it well. So your lemonade ruabza is ready. Now, as I told you before, I'm going to ask so many questions out of this. So, are you ready to solve my questions? All the best. Okay, now before taking quiz from you, let me explain you once again. My step number one was, I took a glass of water. Step number two, I added one spoon full of sugar. Step number three, I added two spoons of lemon juice. And step number four, I added two spoons of rosa. Okay, my question number one is, before adding ruabza, what I added into the lemonade? Yes, I added two spoons of lemon. Very good. Now, before adding lemon into the water, what I added? Yes, I added one spoon full of sugar. And before all these things, the, my first step was taking a glass of water. So class, have you noticed that when I was asking you before step number 4, what, which step came? You told me that before step number 4, step number 3 came. And before step number 3, step number 2 came. And before step number 2, step number 1 came. That means if I am asking you what comes before, you have to take your step back. And you have to go backward to find your answer. To make this topic more clear, let's watch a video. Let's see what do you mean by before numbers. When we count backwards from a given number, we get the numbers before. Let's count backwards the numbers from 7. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. All these are numbers before 7. Where is the ball? It is on number 3. Which number will you get when you count backwards one number? Number 2. Thus, 2 comes before 3. Where is the ball now? It is on number 6. Which number will you get when you count backward one number? Number 5. Thus, 5 comes before 6. Now, look at the ball. It is 
on number 9. Now, let us see the immediate four numbers that come before 9. They are 8, 7, 6, 5. The numbers that come before are always smaller than the given number. Look at the numbers. What comes before 2? 1. What comes after 2? 3. So, we can say that 1 comes before 2. 3 comes after 2. Wasn't it fun to learn after and before with blocks and ball? Hope the topic is clear to you. Bye-bye.